Hi guys and welcome. My name is Chris and this is Bobonics Gaming with Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order Part 4 on PlayStation 4. If you enjoy any of this content then please feel free to like, subscribe and don't forget to ring that notification bell. Hope you enjoy this video, let's get started. Um, so we've just arrived on a new planet, um, Zephyr? Um, okay, I'm going to have to... Uh, yes, so... Good work. Oh, we did it. We did it. I hope you're not hurt. What are you looking at? Who are you talking to? Uh, just my ship. The Manus. Good name, right? Intimidating. Oh, what do you know? You've probably never even flown a ship. Maybe I'll teach you one day, when you're done with your Jedi stuff. I'll even give you a discount. Nice landing, Grease. Me? Oh, yeah. Not a problem. It's easy for a skilled pilot like myself, especially when flying a ship like this. <laughs> Hold that thought. I'm um, just checking on this plan. It doesn't look like there's Looks anything happening. There. Better find more seeds. Uh, yeah, so we just leave that. There's no point in hovering around this area. Let's see what she's got to say. I see you two have been through a lot. It's not easy. No, it's not. But I think of those who believed in me at one point. If I give up on myself, then I give up on them. I'm sure you have a few of those. Prof, a friend on Braca. He sacrificed himself so I could live. He believed in you. A lot of people depend on you, even if they don't know it yet. Keep going, Cal. For Prof. For everyone. <coughs> oh. Okay, so let's have a little look around here. Hey now. Something we can use? A new uh, BD? Oh, okay. So this guy gets skins as well. What'd you find? Imperial excavation storage crate. Sturdy storage containers to transport fragile goods. The outside is made of a heavy metal that can easily withstand Zepho's high winds. Storage crate law. we can use a uh, new poncho as well 
Uh, sure. Let's go for that. What the hell's going on? Where's that coming from? Uh, let's head outside. I think we've checked out everywhere in this this place. What's that? <laughs> They're just like ragging a stormtrooper over there. Watch out, BD. You don't look friendly. Scanning again? Cal. Uh, Stormtrooper may attack efficiently in large numbers, a lightsaber or a flex shots back at them. Imperial Stormtroopers are the frontline soldiers of the Galactic Empire, Conscript conscripted from worlds across the galaxy. They have been trained to support the might of the Imperial War Machine and identify threats indiscriminately. Armed with a variety of weapons, including long-range blaster rifles, they are they are most effective in large numbers, where they may provide where they may prove overwhelming. Oh man, I can't get the words Can out today. The Empire. They found Zeppo. If they were following the Mantis, we would have been swarmed already. Could they be looking for the tombs? Let's hope not. Just got our comms working. I'll try the same workaround to crack into theirs. Scout Trooper Baton. Imperial Electro Baton given to troopers stationed in remote areas where unexpected threats may arise. These weapons were crafted from the same components as Clone Wars era Electro Staffs, but have updated Imperial modifications. This door's not budging. Gaz, so these are called like giant rat things, uh, capable of two different attacks. We'll bite out a prey's heel or lock them down with a leap that cannot be blocked. Opportunistic, often surrounding prey when they are locked down. Scaz are most commonly found in the shade or dark area, areas where they can maintain cooler body temperatures. Due to poor vision, they are especially vulnerable in bright light. They are most dangerous in packs, often biting and locking their jaws onto prey, providing an opportunity for the others to strike. Oh. Uh, which we saw back there as well when they were like, just holding me in place.
mother used this fabric to keep her child warm. They were on the run from something. The Zepho villagers hiding a piece of fabric used by her mother to protect her child. They were on the run trying to escape from something. Um, so I'm, g <laughs> I'm getting the opinion that um, anything that's talked in dialogue is already read out from the card. We'll do a few more to see if that's uh, true and then we'll just skip those ones. Ready for another stim? And there we go. Fall behind, BD1. Oh. Uh, warning. This this area is off limits. Imperial code 94364. No selling or trading. Abandon village. <laughs> Good job. A uh, scout trooper can block limited lightsaber attacks but defenses easily diminished easily defeated in single combat but dangerous in numbers imperial scout troopers are specially trained stormtroopers in service to the galactic empire for a range of missions they are equipped with light armor for a great for greater mobility and specialized helmets uh, that allow for greater adaptability armed with elect electro riot batons when blasted are identified as insufficient. They are especially skilled in melee combat, crowd control, and defense against a lightsaber.
Take her and go. I'll lead them away. Alistair, no! Yeah, so they're already like reading them out, so we don't need to go into those. The sense ones. It's all lies. The Empire just wanted this land. A fiction notice. Uh, civilians must immediately report for re relocation. Looters will be shot. In accordance with Imperial Code 94364, number selling or trading without proper authorization and explicit consent, this property and its belongings are now under the protection of the Galactic Empire. General Marcon, 201st Squadron. Jesus. Um, <clears throat> so I can't really tell the uh, volume levels on this oh, because I'm just recording on where uh, with some different software, so it's a little bit harder to tell. Um, so if you guys uh, are watching this at all and you find some like if the sound is too um, harsh or anything, just let me know in the comments and I'll uh, I'll like correct that straight away. Uh, like I'll have a listen back afterwards uh, to see if I can uh, see if there's any. Um, you know, to see if it's like really bad and unaudible. Um, but yeah, but just put, just let me know what you guys think as well. Underneath part. Just yet. Um, I just want to head back out here because there was a few different um, pathways that we didn't go through. And I don't want to just reset all the enemies just yet. Already cleared out here. So it looks like we're kind of heading to the next area. Lightsaber sleeve. Yeah! <laughs> 
Jesus, that was just a sound cue then. Where do we repair the scomp link? Oh, great. And how the hell do we get back there? I'm just wondering as well, like, are those... No, I'm not going to risk it. I don't think they are little <coughs> things to hang on to. Um, let's leave it here still. We've still got quite a bit of decaying items. Turbine facility. See that by then. These guys hit hard as well, that's like half my health down and like one hit. Archive One Discovery, The Sages. My friend, in the rotation since I left Bogano, I've uncovered more about the Zephyr than I once believed possible. This planet, their homeworld, has been a revelation. It appears many, yet not all, of the Zephyr could wield the Force. They called it the Life Wind, and those who wielded it, Sages. Three names appear with frequency Ilram, Mictrul, Kujet. It seems these sages held assumed positions within their culture. I've informed the council to lukewarm reception. They have become too focused on Jedi history, but the history of the Force belongs to us all.
Okay, no worries. Uh, so I kind of... Oh, you're off, mate. Yeah, so I kind of didn't want to rest in case I could go back and it wasn't wouldn't have been worth clearing out the enemies again. But it doesn't look like we can go back from this position just yet, so... Let's just carry on forward. Let's not go all in on these guys. It seems like there's no uh, staggering of any kind. They just power through attacks, apparently. Could have made that one as well. That looks like a problem. Provoked Philax low vision makes it difficult to change course, often crashing into rocks when charging. Philax hooves adopt, adopted to keep them steady in mountain passes, making them resistant to the push and pull of Zephyr's high winds. Uh, Philax are masterful climbers, able to move with ease on mountain paths. Solitary by nature, they leave their mother's side early to find their own territory. The horns on their heads are their greatest weapon. When two phylics clash, the sound thunders across the mountains. As they age, their horns steadily grow, added, 
adding a new ring for each year of their lives. <sighs> um, I hate. Oh, I'm gonna hate it if I have to face two of those at once or more. So I'm just gonna look. Oh, just wanna look down here because there was that place. Which actually it looks like it just might have been a shortcut. If I carried on that way. Um. Yeah. Anyway. Um. So we're going all the way over to here. I'm hungry. It's reducing the quality of my posture and aim. Doesn't surprise me. Ah! We will pursue you! Oh, what the hell? I think we can't reflect rocket launchers. <laughs> a trooper what the hell man um manipulate and deflect projectiles using the force okay trooper will reload after firing providing time to close the distance and strike rocket launcher troopers are specialized stormtroopers serving the galactic empire's campaign over the galaxy these deadly soldiers are armed with rps6 smart rocket launcher a long-range weapon that's incredibly difficult to deflect Trains to eliminate insurgent activity, diminish uprisings, and quell this dissent. This this they provide an effective means of ground support. Although menacing, their weapon must be reloaded after each shot, allowing targets to evade or attack. Oh, what are these platforms? Even Be one of the Zepho. Guess we're on the right track, huh, BD? Get in there! Oh my 
Feels a rocket launcher trooper. At least we don't have fast travel back. It's literally right through this door. What intel do you have on the Jotaz creature? It's powerful enough to rip arms. Come on! On my way! Stormtrooper commander. Commanders nearby stormtroopers allow focused and synchronized fire on targets equipped with grenades. Uh, that must have been what hit me then. Stormtrooper commanders lead their bata battalions into combat for their galactic empire. Recruited from a countless system, they have been trained to support the oppressive power of the Imperial War Machine. Their strategy and proficiency with an array of weapons allow them to coordinate attack attacks, command ground group maneuvers, and launch deadly assaults. Um, right. Also, I'm gonna get revenge. Hostile approaching! Get up there! Someone's got hilarious. Oh, so I'll go all the way over there. He's the guy that killed me. There. Can we use the force? Tim, yes. <laughs> Don't think we can. We can slow it. I was just checking to see if there weren't any other, like, little hidden pathways. What the f... Can we not do this? Do we have to find another way? Probably we can. It's, a bit, it's hard to get used to these attacks as well because they're like really delayed. They just like they kind of like coil up and then pounce. Blocking. I had my block button down. Oh, man. 
man, that was complete bullshit, man. There's quite a few delays. Um, like my controller is plugged in as well, so there shouldn't be any. of a dead, a villager who died trying to save his family from the Empire. Uh, okay, let's have a quick look at this map. Uh, so there's two ways to go, the rest are blocked. Don't fall behind, BD1. Um, we do have two skills. Let's have a look at the skill tree. <coughs> We've got two points. There's nothing else that we can get over there just yet. Um. that for like a maximum damage kind of thing.
So this has opened up another area. I'm assuming this is where we are meant to be going. So let's have a look. Down this way. We'll just uh, head down this way, then we can. Uh, one over here. Go back and save. Seer, there's a transport ship leaving the Empire's base. I heard. They plan to bring Zepho artifacts to Coruscant. Does that mean? That the Emperor is interested in Zepho? Maybe. Villager <laughs> was wounded, but he took out a trooper. progress anywhere in that direction. Um, uh, but yeah, just uh, back down here. Have a rest at this spot and then carry Moving on. Out. Is there like a higher wall up there? Assault Trooper. Shielded, heavy, long range, rapid fire weapon capable of sustaining numerous hits. Slow movement, long wind, wind up before firing, and cooldown period after attack provide opportunities to attack. Uh, the heavy assault troopers are specialized infantry serving the Galactic Empire on the front lines of war. They are primarily trained to defend combat zones as support squads to stormtrooper patrols. They are highly proficient with the Z. 6 rotary blaster cannon which fires off steady rapid long range bursts capable of inflicting heavy damage and shielded by a low emitter energy ray help Can't wait to watch these grow. New terrarium seed. I, I have no idea what they do yet.
Oh, okay. What's that be you want? Is this where we're yeah. yeah, this is where we meant to go. Just missed the pipe. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I need one. That's the guy that killed me last time on the bridge. In accordance with the Emperor's will, we've occupied Zepho, redistributing its inhabitants. This planet has failed to yield significant data or relics for Project Augur. Its electromagnetic winds have rendered the bulk of our mining technology useless. Meanwhile, more stormtroopers lose their lives to dangerous fauna. We will not be able to fulfill our directive here. It is my recommendation that we disband the project and leave a token outpost to keep scavengers from stealing our technology. Trooper Commander, able to block parry and use specialized spin techniques, strongest strongest stamina than their subordinates. Scout Trooper Commanders lead squads of specially trained stormtroopers into combat for the Galactic Empire. Scout Commanders armed with riot battalions are extremely adept in melee combat and should not be taken lightly. Uh, yes, they need quite a lot of blocking twice to take that guard down. An enemy! Here! I'm winning oh, Oh, I need some heals. Come back here. What do we find? 
lightsaber switch. Empire's pinpointed your location. You need to move fast. On it. Thanks. Oh, that was handy. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, I think I will go into that um, Max Force as well. Oh, for the ship. Stim here. something. What do they know? No mention of Cordova. 
I don't think the Empire knows he's been here. Then we have the advantage. For now. Some med speed one. Interesting. We're on the right track. Can't get through. There's a storm up ahead. Something about it crippled the Empire's equipment. I can feel something pulling me there, beyond the storm. Follow it. Let the force sharpen your instincts. All right. I'll do my best. Oh, we've got another one of those ram guys up ahead as well. Could we just drop down? I think we could just drop down in this area. Um. Ah, but we have been uh, playing for a while. I think I am going to cut this episode here. Um, yeah, just because it's, it's running on a bit, like, I think we're up to an hour now. Um, so, thank you guys for watching this far, and if you'd like to show your support for the channel, then please click that like and subscribe button at the bottom of this video. Uh, thanks again, and hopefully you, got, uh, you guys will join me in the next video. Take care.